Buckle up, folks, because it's starting. Coming to a bank near you. Check this out. We've taken another step towards a cashless society. A big bank has confirmed customers in some locations can no longer withdraw money over the counter as branches continue to wind back services. It's up there with the pub with no beer, the bank with no cash. ANZ has confirmed some branches no longer handle cash at the counter. Others are directing customers to smart ATMs for cash transactions. The latest figures on ATMs shows the number of machines has more than halved from almost 14,000 back in 2017 to around 6,000 in the middle of last year. For years, cash was king. But not anymore. Hello there. I wondered if you had any change for a fifty dollar note. No, I don't have any cash. <laughs> don't use cash anymore these days. No, definitely not. No change at all. Never, never. Not having cash is much more convenient. For the first time since dollars and cents were introduced. Oh yeah, shit is about to get serious. Well, things have already been serious, but it's about to get even more serious out this motherfucker. I've already experienced going to the bank trying to take out like a thousand, a couple. You know what I'm saying? A few dollars, which is nothing, right? I try to take out what I thought was like a little amount of money. And they told me that they didn't hold that type of money inside the bank. I was like, what? That was like, yeah, you can only pull out like 300. I was like, what the fuck is that? Why do I even have you guys? If I can't come out and pick up and take out large sums of money, why, why am I putting large sums of money inside you guys? Make it make sense. But yeah, after I experienced that, I went and called all my folks, my grandma, my mama, everybody and was like, hey, you need to start taking your money out the banks because they getting ready, they getting ready to do something major. You know what I'm saying? I just went up in there and they wouldn't even let me pull out this amount. Okay? Now, if they having trouble and problems with letting people pull out this amount, there is a huge issue going on behind the scenes that we don't know about. And you need to take your money out so you can be safe. I went and I called everybody, told them, and now look at what I'm seeing. Even more of this shit. And I know a lot of you Americans are going to be oblivious to what's going on because it's not hitting you right in your face. It's not at home, but that's your fucking problem. You're arrogant, okay? If it ain't right there in front of your face for you to see, touch, smell, or whatever, you, for some reason, don't think anything is going on. You think it's fake or you think it's propaganda and all. Like, man, the arrogance is crazy. But if this is going on in Australia, guaranteed, that shit is already going on over here and they've already tampered with all the banking systems and all of that. Like, something major is about to go down. The NWO is really about to kick off. Yeah, like a football game. Now, the NWO been around making moves for a long time. Like, when they say, oh, the new world order is about to start and all of that, the shit's been started. It's just, you don't see the residuals or the effects of anything until years and years and years and years upon years later. And that's where we're at today. We're years upon years later of them pressing that button. Now we're about to start seeing all this shit transpire and shut down. Because this right here is wild, man. This is wild. And it's kind of scary. Because imagine you got hundreds of thousands of dollars, millions of dollars, all type of, like, Imagine you got crazy amounts of money stored and saved away in the bank. You wake up one day, you go to go take out your money. <laughs> nothing. You can't access anything. And then when you go to the tellers or anything like that, they're basically there for fucking nothing. Because they don't have an explanation for shit. They can't tell you nothing. They don't have anybody you can call for some reason. Now, they um everything is an automated system to where you can't talk to an actual human being. You got to send shit in for AI to respond. Like, it's a big ass problem man it's a it's a big ass problem but people better start paying attention man and stop being oblivious because like i said shit is about to get serious out here shit is about to get really real because it's already been real but now i'm done now i want to know what y'all think about this does this like put you back a little bit does this kind of frighten you does this make you a little timid on putting your money inside the banks does this make you want to go take your money out the banks right now like how does this make you feel and i already know this is a unsettling feeling or situation to be in because damn like this is a nail biter for sure a, an extreme nail biter but like i said i want to know what you what your thoughts are how you feeling all that stuff when it's coming to these banks and them shutting down and them taking people's money and running and all of that let me know man drop it in the comments